friends. Today we're going to be reading a story called Goodbye Summer, Hello Autumn by Kennard Peck. And autumn is just kind of a different word for the word fall. So it was just the first day of fall the other day, so that is why we're going to read this story. So let's get started. <laughs> All right. Hello, late summer morning. Hello, trees. Hello. Now that the cool winds have come, we love how our branches sway in the sun. Hello, playful foxes and singing blue jays. Hello, we are busy looking for food. Some of us are headed south for our win to our winter homes. Hello, walking stick and butterfly. Hello, we're, we're surprised you saw us. We're trying our best to blend in and we'll do the same in warmer places. See where the walking stick is? Looks just like the stick. And then the butterfly's wings look like the leaves. Hello beavers, hello chipmunks. Hello, we have no time to play because we're making cozy nests and dens. It will be cold soon and we want to be ready. Hello flowers. Hello, we are leaning into the sun enjoying the last summer rays. Some of us, like asters and follicks, are late bloomers. We make the end of the season even more colorful. Hello thunder. Hello, you can hear my low rumble from far away. My clouds loom over the open fields and quiet hills. Hello, breezy wind. Hello, I love to whoosh, drizzle, and leaves through the misty streets. Hello, chill in the air. Hello, it's time to break out your thick sweaters and scarves. That's starting to happen this time of year, wearing sweaters to stay warm. Hello, puddle. Hello, now that the wind has come, I often get covered with leaves. Let's see down here. Hello, leaves. Hello. We are changing our colors. Some of us turn red or brown, while others of us turn gold or yellow. The dog leaves turn purple. So many colors. Hello, big orange sun. Hello. I am setting earlier and earlier now that summer is coming to an end, but I will see you again tomorrow. Goodbye, Summer. Hello, Autumn. All right, the end. So after listening to this story, you guys will need to find this piece of paper that came in your backpack that you picked up when you came to school. So with this bare tree, I want you to use any sort of things you have at home to decorate it. So markers, crayons, colored pencils, paint, to make it look like your trees do in fall. And then you are going to put my leaves and then finish the sentence. So you could say my leaves are brown, my leaves are falling, my leaves are changing, whatever you want to finish the sentence. And then once you're done decorating your fall tree, I want you to upload a picture to Seesaw so your teacher can see.